Hi, Dr. Vincent Pasquale with NSI, and one of the conditions I, I really feel proud that we can affect are, are COPD. Um, if you're unaware, COPD is chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Uh, there are a lot of diff different conditions that combine to be, that's a blanket term. Uh, it can mean chronic bronchitis, it can mean interstitial pleuritis, it can mean emphysema, as well as pulmonary fibrosis and extrinsic asthma. So when we have a disease like COPD, what that really represents, and this is the take home message that I give to patients, is that we have damage or dysfunction in our lung tissue. Once we understand that, then it's, it's understandable why those individuals never get better with medication. And, and it's simple because medication isn't designed to heal tissue. Medication isn't designed to restore function. It's designed for periods of crisis. So during a period of crisis, if we have the inability to breathe, then we have rescue inhalers to dilate the bronchi so that we can breathe. We have nebulizer treatments to help perform some of the same activities in terms of reducing inflammation. But there's no long-term effect to those uh, interventions. And as a result, COPD patients will just chronically progress to the end stage, and the end stage obviously isn't pretty. What we've been able to do in this environment in uh, stem cell therapy is we're able to get a population of stem cells from your tissues to the damaged tissue in your lungs, and as a result, we can see great improvements in the function of lung tissue itself in order to oxygenate your blood, but also in repair and regeneration of that tissue so that we can promote a long-term effect. You know, we have lots of patients that we've treated where, you know, they had an inability to walk any distance uh, without being out of breath. You know, their quality of life was really poor because they weren't able to do anything, and after the first infusion, they are able to do quite a bit. Uh, we had one woman who was confined to bed for like 16 hours a day, I'll never forget her, she only had one lung, um, and she was mowing her lawn the, the very next day, which I wasn't a proponent for, but um, we could see some amazing things, primarily because of the tools that we use or the tools that we have at our disposal. We don't manage symptoms. What we do is we provide a resource to heal and regenerate tissue and promote function long-term.